Hi everyone, welcome in this video. Today I'm gonna show you guys how you can make a working DJ booth with the songs that you like in Roblox Studio. Now it's very simple and on the other hand, not so simple. So you gotta pay attention. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna open Roblox Studio. And for this tutorial I'm gonna make a new game and I start from the base plate. So I click base plate and then I have my new game and then I'm gonna add a model. Now to find the model you have to make sure that the toolbox is visible and you, if it's not visible then you can go to views and press this little icon with a hammer and then it will become visible. And then you have to go to the creator store which you can do by pressing this icon, uh, the little bag icon. If you press it then the creator store is visible and then you can search on the term Gabber. That way you will find my DJ boot model and if you click it then you first get a message, you press OK and then you see that the DJ boot is added to my new game. Now first I want to move this DJ boot a little, so I go model, move, I move it a little to put it at a good location like this. And then uh, the DJ boot doesn't work yet, so I first I have to do some things. I see here in the explorer, now if the explorer is not visible you can go to view and press explore on the top left corner to make it visible. And then you see that in the workspace there is the DJ boot model and then if I press the little uh, triangle next to it then you see two folders, one is called ungroup in starter player scripts and the other is called ungroup in workspace and so you simply have to do that. How do I do that? I put my mouse on this folder and then I click, I do right mouse click and then you see a lot of words and you, you click cut. So now this folder has disappeared and I go to starter player, I press the little triangle and then you see starter player scripts, I click on it and then right mouse click, paste into and then you see that the folder is, uh, is now in the starter player scripts, you do right mouse click and then you can ungroup, you click ungroup and then that's done. Then you take the folder which is called ungroup in workspace, right mouse click Cut, you go to workspace, right mouse click, paste into, and then right mouse click on this folder, ungroup, and then your DJ boot should work. So let's test it to see if it works. I press play. Okay, so now I see the DJ boot here, and if I press the play button, then I get a menu. Now I've already added some songs to the a DJ boot which should work for everyone because they are on the Roblox website and they are available for everyone so if I press one of these songs and I press play then you see on this little screen you see the name of the song and you also hear the song so the DJ boot works. Now there's also an option to add a Roblox idea if you press here this button idea then you can add a code here now this is the code for it's raining tacos so you can play that song by pressing play here and you see raining tacos it's on the screen and you hear this song as well. Now how, how can I add new tracks to the DJ boot? Let me show you. So first I go to the Roblox website then I see here the word create and I click it. And then I have, let me first add a song which is in the Roblox store because that's the easiest and then later I will show you guys, guys how you can upload your own songs and how you can add them to the game. But first let me go to the store by pressing store. Then audio, you click audio and then you can search for a song. Now I click electronic and then you see a lot of songs. Now let me try this one, Dream Computer. Okay, that sounds nice. Now how can I add this song to my game? I need two things for that. Uh, the first is the name of the song, which here is a Dream Computer and, for, and I also need a, a Roblox ID and I can get that by pressing more info and then it's this code that I need. The numbers after asset slash, so only the numbers, right mouse click, copy, uh, and then I can add it to my game. How do I do that? I see in the, on the radio you see tracks and then I press the little plus next to it and then I type in sound. 
I click sound and now you see that in my list of songs you also have here this one sound which is the new thing that I added and then I paste my code which I just copied here so right mouse click paste and then I press enter and you see it's loaded so the song is loaded and I can now play it in my game now I also want to change the title uh, it was dream computer so I type in the title here so that you see the right thing in the list so if I uh, play my game now play then a new song should be in the list so let's check that I go to the DJ boot I press uh, the play button and now the song is in the list so you see it here I click it and I press play and now I just hear the song which I just added so it works the next thing I'm going to show you is you have a certain song which you really really like and you want the song to be on your DJ boot so bad but the song is not in the Roblox store. I'm going to show you how you can add it to the DJ boot. We go to the Roblox website again and then I click dashboard, development items, then I click audio and then I can upload a song there. I click upload asset then upload and then I can se select a file now you have to make sure that the file is an mp3 file or OGG because only those files can be uploaded to Roblox now the song I want to add is Chaos by D Tags, which is a really nice song and I open it then I scroll down and here if I press this button then the song will upload once you have uploaded your song you have to wait a little because Roblox has to check if your song doesn't contain any dirty words, if it's not copyright, if it doesn't have any unintelligible... Now in order to add this new track to my game I'm going to do the same as I did before so I take the code which I see in the URL after asset slash I copy it then I go to Roblox Studio tracks I press the little plus next to tracks then I type in sound to add a sound object I click sound then I click click this object and then in the properties I can paste my code so I paste it here, I press enter, then I see the song is loaded and then I change the title, D tags chaos, which is the name of the song and then the new song is added to my DJ boot. That's basically everything you need to know to make a working DJ boot with the songs that you like in Roblox Studio. I hope you liked this video, thank you very much for watching and see you next time, bye bye!